Hi, I'm Lawrence Budd. I'm an irrigation specialist with the Pasadena Water and Power Water Conservation Program. Welcome to a short video on how to program your sprinkler controller. I'll be showing you how to set your controller for certain days, start times, and length of run, all the time being careful to avoid overwatering, underwatering, and runoff. Here we have one of the most typical types of controllers. Now yours may not be this exact one, but they all have the same basic features. I'm going to show you step by step how to program this controller to create an exact schedule for the week. The first and obvious thing to look for is if the controller has power or not. Be sure to plug the controller in. Some controllers have a 9 volt battery backup in case of a power outage. Once the controller is turned on, the next step is to set the date and time. Some newer controllers will know the date and time automatically when turned on. On this controller, we'll set it manually. Your controller might have a choice of programs. For this module, let's use program A. Now let's decide what days we want to program. Many areas have restrictions for certain days. Please check PasadenaSavesWater.com. For this demonstration, we'll use Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Next, let's choose the best times of day to water our lawn. Early morning is the best. The water does not evaporate too quickly and has a chance to soak in before it gets hot. And here's a neat trick. Let's set four start times in the morning, say 12 a.m., 2 a.m., 4 a.m., and 6 a.m. I'll show why we're doing this in just a minute. The next part is where most people get confused. It's knowing how long each station or zone should run for. What's too much? What's not enough? Well, not to fear, we use information from the National Weather System to figure out just how much water your lawn and shrubs need to do well. We boil these numbers down into minutes per week so you can enter them into your controller. Since our lawn has spray heads, I know that we should run our heads for one hour per week in the hot summer. So I'm going to set all of my lawn zones to run for five minutes. This means that each zone will run four times for five minutes on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. This will total 12 complete cycles, or 60 minutes per week. And that's the basic programming to have a weekly watering schedule. Remember that all the zones run one after the other. So why did I break the runs into several short ones instead of one long one? It's because of the leading cause of water waste, and that's water runoff. Most systems water much too quickly, resulting in water runoff after several minutes. By creating several short runs, I give the water a chance to soak in before it leaves. Now some controllers have a percentage feature. This can make your life easier and save a lot of water. If you have this feature, set it at 100% for the summer setting I showed you before. In September, don't change any of the run times or days in Program A, just lower the percentage to 80%. This reduces the time on all of the zones. In October, lower it to 60%, and so on until you reach 20% in December, January, and February. Once you've set your controller, be sure to check that the zones go off at the right time. If they're not, there's a good chance one of the steps was entered incorrectly. Now, I know that a lot of the controllers out there are ancient and very hard to program. If this is your case, please consider purchasing a new controller. The new ones are computerized and do a lot of great different things. Another important tip, please don't assume that your lawn mowing company are experts in programming controllers. We want you to personally know how your controller is set. Overwatering can cost a lot, and watering on a restricted day can result in a fine. Remember, if it's your property, you're responsible for the water use, even if you didn't set the controller. Until next time, I'm Lawrence Budd. By using these tips, you'll have a healthier, greener landscape that'll save you water and money.